Okay. So today I want to play some uh, super flat at night. Uh, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to start an old world 1.17.1 1. uh, <clears throat> before they expanded the uh, the build height and lowered the build height. Uh, it was at minus 62, I think. Um, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to create an old world and, uh, and then I'm going to update it to a new world. We're going to call this uh, Nightmare Super Flat and uh, you'll see what I mean. I'm going to put it on hard mode. I got to turn on cheats just long enough to get it switched over. Um, okay, but here we go. So yeah, so we're creating this in 1.17.1. 1. Okay, all right, lots of slimes. Shocking. Okay, there's a there's a town. All right, so let's see. Game rule. Is it uh, do daylight cycle? Okay, so you set that to false. Do daylight cycle. And now there will be no daylight cycle, day, day night cycle. Uh, all right. Now we're going to set the time to about 16,000. And right. that's the middle of the night. Okay. So now we're closing this down. We're going to restart it in 1.21. But yeah, this is this is how you get all the structures in modern uh, super flat. So instead of it starting you off at minus uh, 62 build limit, like it, like modern 1.21 does, uh, it's going to be like four. But you'll be able to go below bedrock, and you'll see what I mean for the uh, the uh, time trials. They actually exist. They spawn below uh, bedrock. So uh, first things first, I need to get in that light because there's. Nothing but skeletons, zombies, uh, witches, creepers, of course. Man, I tell you, the uh, I did this before. The uh, the baby zombies. Oh my god, the baby zombies are the worst. Because they're like just as fast as you are. Um, uh, shoot. See, there's, okay, there's the iron golem. I'm going to get close to my buddy over here. Um, hopefully, we can find some armor. Uh, I need armor really bad. Oh shit, uh, Jesus! <laughs> Come on, buddy, help me out here. I gotta be real careful with these golems, though, um, because I cannot survive a hit from them uh, without armor. It's just a one-shot kill, so. Um, as far as, uh, I know this isn't technically hardcore, I'm gonna, I'm gonna play this like it's hardcore, where if I die, this, uh, this series is gonna end, but, um, uh, I don't know how to make, um, this broken version of Super Flat, I don't know how to do this in, in hardcore, if anybody knows, get off me, if anybody knows, uh, you know, let me know in the comment section, that would be awesome, but I'm gonna, I'm gonna, you know, Give me my word, I'm going to play it legit. And if I die, uh, this world's done. So I'll delete it as soon as I die. Uh, my buddy go. Where are you, buddy? There you are. Okay, come on, over here. This way, this way. But, um, but yeah, if you know how to set it to hardcore, um, because I, I don't see the option anymore. Maybe there's a mod or something I could get that does it. Walk right past you. Get that guy. Um, yeah, my strategy is I'm gonna try to bounce from town to town until I find some armor, and uh, and then once I do, I can I can set up shop for a little bit. Um, strongholds do spawn, they're kind of rare, obviously, uh, but the, the lava, the way they, the, the lava that they have in them should make them pretty obvious in the sky, even at night, that'll be the only thing that's lit up in the sky, so, um, everything else, though, is ground level or below ground level. Got your towns, of course. You got your ghost towns. You got uh, uh, what do you call them? The portals. He is busted up. It's not gonna. It's 
not going to be able to help me out much longer. <clears throat> Trying to get a little organized here. Usually there's a bunch of hay laying around. I don't, I don't see any hay, though. <laughs> Useless. Um, I am going to leave a lot of job blocks because uh, what's unique about this... Um, this uh, super flat at night is without the day night cycle I found this out in my last uh, attempt to do this without the day night cycle oh my god these baby zombies are gonna be the death of me come on follow me come on big guy help me out here I think I'll duck in here for a minute The uh, I never realized how much range zombies have until playing, uh, you know, the night version of uh, Minecraft. These guys come from like miles away. there. Jesus. Collect some torches. Um, I was gonna say about the job blocks. Uh, I don't collect a lot of job blocks because it's very difficult. I had a hard time getting uh, any of the uh, villagers that I led to my uh, nighttime city. I couldn't get them to accept uh, the job blocks. So I did get like one villager to accept. Jeez, what the fuck? Sorry, language, sorry. Uh, God. There was a way to get him to follow me without risking my life. Jesus, more zombies. I need to get out of here. This, there's just not enough lights in this, uh, this little village. More stuff is spawning in all the time. Um, what I was saying is the with the job blocks. Oh, he died. Okay. There we go. Alright, let's get out of here. This looks uh, much... This this little city looks much better off. Lit up, so. uh, the job blocks, they, uh, they don't accept it. And uh, the ones that did accept... They uh, they don't reset their trades, so I built uh, I built a big farm. I have my my carrots, my potatoes, my uh, my wheat, and um, and I sold a ton of uh, potatoes and carrots and wheat to uh, to my village traders. Uh, it's hard to talk and think at the same time. Um, yeah, I tried to. I, well, I didn't try. I did sell. There we go. I just need food. I did sell all my, um, most of my potatoes and uh, carrots to to my villagers, but because the day night cycle is canceled and time is essentially frozen, um, you know, the, not only does the moon not move in the sky and the sun's never gonna come up, but the uh, the villagers they don't reset their trades, so. What I'm gonna, what I'm gonna try to do in this game is I'm just going to focus on the librarians because, um, you know, librarians you can you know pop their their little um, oh my god what are they called their lecterns you can pop their lecterns down and uh, and keep popping them down and get you know hopefully a, a, a enchantment book that you want. Um, Maybe I'll, I'll probably do an armor and a tool uh, villager if I can. <clears throat> Let's see. I'll get down for a minute. <sighs> yeah, I'm not finding any... Uh, real unfortunate start here. I'm not finding any armor so far. Um to find some armor so at least a, a very well lit village so uh, <laughs> I can get some iron um, right now there's so many monsters at night I'm just basically letting the iron golem die and uh, just collect his iron but I'm gonna need a lot more than that once I once I find a stronghold or I get uh, some armor. I can hunker down for a little bit, create a, uh, a little iron farm, at least short term. Uh, 
but you know get a good uh, I don't want to I don't want to <clears throat> make a permanent base I'm going to make my permanent base where the uh, the stronghold is but um yeah I'll be able to uh you know get some get some iron uh get some armor get some tools etc cetera, etc cetera. so Point and leaving all these torches up when I'm just gonna abandon these villages anyway. So it's this way I can get some stone tools. <clears throat> yep, yep, yep. It's hoping to either find some iron armor or, God forbid, you know, a diamond pickaxe, something. Yeah, diamond a diamond pickaxe is gonna be tricky. Last time I did this, I wasn't recording. Um, so grab this, Get some more iron. Um, yeah, diamonds are. <laughs> there's no ores, obviously, and it's really hard to get trades all the way up to master level when. They don't reset so you know normally i would be trading you know stone or sticks or or food you know over and over and over again um i'm not sure i'm going to be able to do that so i might just have to get get a good set of armor <clears throat> I'll, I'll make myself a good set of armor hopefully a little mob grinder so i can get some levels and uh maybe i'll get lucky and find an, enough um diamonds to make a um chanting table but getting the obsidian for for an enchanting table or even another portal is going to be tricky <sighs> and i'm not good at this game okay um if you're expecting a hardcore minecraft player that that ain't me um i've just recently started playing this so i'm very mediocre I don't claim to be a pro, so uh, or zombies, of course. Just waiting for me, just hanging around outside, wait for me to come out. <clears throat> oh Jesus! Come on, dude. Do your job, man. Protect me. These they don't have much left in them. More zombies. God. Normally, I didn't have this much trouble in the last version I played. Um, maybe this hardcore, they're not lit up as well. I don't know. I know why. Uh, the last time I played this, oh, there's freaking zombies everywhere. Last time I played this, um, the first thing I did was just hunker down in the city I started at and just, you know, cooked up a bunch of torches charcoal oh he killed him okay but yeah i hunkered down cooked a bunch of charcoal um made a bunch of torches and just lit up this huge area so uh that might be that might be the smarter move if i don't find iron in the next uh, town or two that's that's what i'll do i'll uh just uh, hunker down, make a little iron farm, maybe even a, a mob grinder, enchanting table. Uh, I ain't gotta be pretty. I can make a, a mob grinder out of dirt, no problem. Uh, this looks pretty, pretty well. Lit. It's so weird. Some of these um, these towns, um, and it looks like this might be one. Some of these towns they they generate so weird, and I think that's an effect of. Um, I suspect it's an effect of creating an old uh, the game in the old world and then modernize it. Look at that tree. That tree's missing like leaves on one side. I haven't been and there's there's half a house on my right. Um crazy, so. Um uh, but oh yeah, structures that exist in the broken broken super flat. Uh, when you when you Create an old world updated. Um, you've got train tracks. There's even um, uh, there's even uh, up, 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 up. what do you call them? Um, mine carts, mine carts with with uh, with um, the cart 
Ugh, I can't speak. Mine carts with chests, whatever that's called. Just, just my carts with chests. Uh, there's those on some of the rails, so you got to keep an eye out for those. I've even seen uh, mobs, the spider spawners, just right there in the open. And of course, those are going to be dangerous at nighttime because you slap a uh, torch on them real quick. Because at nighttime, they're just going to go crazy making spiders. Okay. And they're cave spiders, too. So they got that that poison. They're not normal um, okay. spiders. But yeah, there'll be little little spider spawners just sitting there and right on the ground. Uh, what else you got? You got... Um, it's kind of pointless to collect. You got... Uh, I said the portals, the broken portals. Got those. You got the uh, pillager, pillager outpost. They spawn. So you got the time trials, pillager outposts, um, villages, uh, mine carts, train tracks, spider spawners. Um, yeah, tons of good stuff. The uh, the time trials are so weird though because you know. Depending on how it generates, sometimes it's it's hard to get below bedrock. Sometimes it's super easy. Um, but we are gonna have to have to have to have to have some enchanted gear uh, before we go in there. I always always get lost in the time trials. Um, I don't know what it is. I, I mean, I'm, I'm not good at this game. That's what it is. But um, I don't know if like do y'all have. <clears throat> do y'all have trouble with the time trials? Do y'all get lost real easy? Every time I go in there, uh, I end up um, getting lost. And I lost, I had a really good start on one of these worlds. On this, ooh, there we go. Good old stone axe. Two crits dead. Um. Uh, yeah, I had a really good start. I was really proud of myself. I had the mom grinder. I had a nice little perimeter set up. Um, you know, a little. It was just like a, a two. It was a two block high dirt wall, but it was something. It was it was enough to make me feel secure at night. So, um, yeah, but I had a nice little start going, man. I had a chaining table, access to the nether. I was rocking, and then I went to time trial and I brought a bed with me and oh, excuse me burp and I uh I I I set my um uh, set my spawn on the bed and I died and then I I picked up the bed or something I don't know what I did because it didn't spawn me I had to have picked up the bed. I think that's what happened. Because when I died and I came back, just up here. When I died and I came back, though, um, it was uh, I was out in the middle of nowhere. I think it, I think it put me back uh, at you know zero zero zero. I think it put me back at starting uh, coordinates. Oh my god! I had no idea where my base was from there. So. I must have spent hours trying to retrace my steps because um I was I was primarily running into the sun when this you know when I say that I mean like primarily running east you know um yeah but I lost I lost my freaking world because I, I I didn't write down the coordinates or anything like that so <sighs> this village is a little disappointing all these really are I'm not finding any good chess. I don't know what's going on. Need those. I mean, I might need one eventually. It's just, it's not on my to-do list. There's no point worrying about uh, redstone and lapis lazuli when, uh, lazuli, lazuli? I don't know, how do, how do you say it? Tell me in the comments. There's no point worrying about that, though. When, you know. I can die so easily. This is so so much harder on hard. I'm used to playing normal, so like one creeper blows up on you and you're gone. It's ridiculous, man. But um, but yeah, you guys have my word. I'm gonna be 
I'm gonna be 100% real with y'all. Um, no, no phony stuff. You know, a lot of people they uh, they they make fake hardcore worlds and they've got safe states and things like that. You know, I'm not I'm not gonna do that. Honestly, I d I don't care enough to do that. Um, there's really no point in in uh, in lying to people. I, I find that so revolting. You know, it, it, the whole point of this is, you know, that one misstep, one one lacks of a uh, ca of caution, and you know, you could die. And if you've got safe states and you're cheating and whatnot, it's just it's just pathetic in my opinion. Um, hopefully, there he is. Okay. I always try to I always try to find the iron golem when I come to these uh, these new villages. And he's already going to town on some slimes. One thing I notice is, um, and y'all probably notice it too, it's like at night. Maybe it's because it's a it's a, a, a busted super flat world. There's like so few slimes. I guess um, I don't know how the mechanics of the game work, but I guess I guess if it's spawning like more spiders and zombies, and, and here comes a bunch of them. Look at that. It's like the freaking Walking Dead. <clears throat> I guess if it's spawning a bunch of them, then there's just not as much room for slimes. There's going to be fewer slimes because there's all this other stuff spawning. So, there's some wheat. Might get that. Oh, yeah, no chests, man. This is ridiculous. And y'all, y'all have to forgive me. Like I said, I'm not good at this game. I get confused. I get dizzy really easy. Um, just gotta chill here for a second. Let them clear out the way a little bit so I can search without being chased by half a dozen zombies. <sighs> Sorry, I apologize if, if you know if you're watching this and you've got a nice view of the inside of a, a room because I'm hiding all the time. I I do apologize. I'll be a little braver once I get a. Get some armor and a, and a real weapon, I promise. Yeah, I think for sure I'd find something. You know, a freaking pickaxe, man. Diamond chest piece. Here's what I was talking about. See? See how you've got the uh, the little rails? That ran right into a house, too. I love the weird spawns, though. Yeah, for once, there's like nobody breathing down my neck. I'll mine a couple of these. <clears throat> My carts with chests, though. Yeah, see, I ran right into the house, though. <clears throat> I kind of messed up the house generation. Yeah, that's why I keep calling it a uh, broken super flat world. If you're wondering why I'm knocking these down, it's just I th maybe it's a dumb idea. I think it's pretty smart. You get four tur four turches at once. <laughs> Plus a wood block that I can turn into a piece of charcoal, so it's not just a plank. Uh, try to I'm trying to be trying to be as effective with my time as possible. You know, <laughs> you could tell I'm paranoid because I I'm like moving the entire time. I just keep moving, keep moving, keep moving. Let's see. <sighs> oh, 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 I thought that would have killed him. Oop. And of course, there's a baby zombie. Of course. I mean, why wouldn't there be? Oh, now we <laughs> a zombie just like drove by and killed him. I thought, okay, baby ran off. That's the most fortunate. Hey, go chase your baby. Go chase your baby zombie. Get rid of some garbage. If <sighs> I can survive long enough to make it to a stronghold, I should be okay. As long as I get some feather falling on some boots. Or maybe, um, shoot. 
I don't know why I'm a black woman, by the way. I last time I played, I was uh, I don't think I was a black woman. I thought I was Steve, but um, I don't know. Maybe I, I changed the settings or something. Like I said, not good at this game. Don't claim to be. I just enjoy playing. So let me take my trusty crafting table. I think they're gone. I think it's safe to go out. We'll, we'll see, won't we? Here's a zombie villager. <sighs> Keep picking up this rock flesh that's everywhere. Alright. There's a bunch of villages on the horizon. I wish I'd found a saddle. This is so much easier when you have uh, find you a saddle. There's, there's like a horse in like every other village. And this is, this is so much safer. You know, at night. As long as I, I eat when I can. Oh, here we go. Here we go. We're in luck. We are in luck. This is what I was talking about. Right. Self out real quick. Oh, check it out. Look. Kinds of goodies. Eat this stuff, but who knows? Ah. Yeah, some good stuff. Those pumpkin seeds will come in uh, handy later. I love using jack o' lanterns to light up things. You know, it makes a, it makes a really great uh, hidden light source. You know, I'll show you if, if if I last that long. I'll show you a trick I learned. I'm sure you all. This game's old as, as dirt. Uh, I'm sure y'all know this, but I know a couple ways to, to hide some lighting so you don't have just like torch spam everywhere. Oh, there's another one. Okay. <clears throat> All right. What do we got? Oh, check it out. Some lapis lazuli. Uh, you're not going to leave me alone, are you? Oh, come on. Good. All the stuff I can just get later. I've got my mom crying. Oh my god, where'd you come from? Thank god you're a zombie. If you've been a creeper, I'd be dead. See what I mean? Look at him. Look at him. Here comes three more. Ridiculous. I gotta eat too. I'm very disorganized, as you can tell. Items just everywhere in my inventory. I want that lapis lazuli, though. Might come in handy. Especially if I can't. Oh, I got some melon seeds. Eh, beetroot. Don't really need that. I, I've never... And I know this probably because I'm a noob or whatever, but uh, I've never used beetroot for anything. I don't even know what it's used for, honestly. I think it's like some kind of soup or something. If you know what beetroot's for, let me know in the comments. Um, because I find it everywhere. I just, I have, no, I have no idea what it's used for. Is it just for trading with villagers? Or is there some good use for it, like potions or something? I don't know. All right, I got a couple, got a couple villages here all bundled up. That one on the right looks pretty promising. There's a lot of light for that one. I'm loving all these little train tracks, man. That's awesome. That's some good stuff. Oops. They are already being harassed by zombies. That's not good. And that's, see, that's what I'm talking about. Like, just running up to this village, there's already zombies spawned in the village. Oh, I've been here. I've been here, that's why there's zombies. See how the uh, the fence posts don't have the little... Oops, my bad, my bad. Yep, somehow I, I ran to a village that I've already been to. 
But that's another reason why I do that that little trick with the uh, the blocks. I, I call it trick like it's something fancy. <laughs> yeah, the, the 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 technique that I've developed. But yeah, but you know, see how when it's, when you've got these little blocks with the four torches on, <clears throat> you know you haven't been here before. Because otherwise, I would have collected those. And again, horses. Look, this is a cute little village. I like this. It's very properly lit up. Uh, have I been here? Why is this door open? Yeah, I have been here. Pretty sure I have. Oh. Got a, got a fairly decent chunk of iron. <sighs> Trying to decide <clears throat> what my next move is going to be. Yeah, I've been here. Spider jockey. <sighs> oh my god, more baby zombies. so hard to hit just about anything else I can easily get a crit on it's a witch maybe alone you know rocking suit of gold armor see look see on the left see that house it's like half of it didn't even spawn it's crazy There's my guy, my iron gold. <laughs> Just trying to get my bearings. I was like, what the fuck is that? It's a sheep. A sheep? Is that witch? So I think it's the same one. Gotta be careful when you've got a room with like two, three villagers in it, because they will open that door on you. That's so weird. Okay. Ugh. And of course, there's no chess. I'm surprised I haven't seen any, um, they call it the blacksmiths, right? Blacksmith with the lava furnaces. But I would have, I would have made a, uh, bucket already. Because lava is very useful. It's good for, it's good for killing golems. It's good for killing slimes. Great for killing slimes. Yeah, if you got a, a room with a bunch of villagers, I've literally been like looking out the, uh, the little window in the door, and uh, villagers come up behind me and decided to, to walk out to the middle of the night and just kill me. So it'll be like little baby zombies right outside the door, and in their infinite wisdom, the villagers open up uh, the door, put everything in. 
course, I'm not prepared for that, so I die. <sighs> he's, he's, he's trying to protect me. He's, he's doing what he can. He's a good guy. Be serious. Ooh, that dude's got a sword. This is rough. Oh, that's redstone. Redstone dust. Ooh, you are. You've seen better days, my friend. Please don't hit me. It just never stops. Yeah, see, there's a uh, see that right in front of me. That's a time trial. Yep. Shouldn't it shouldn't be too much longer that we come across a uh, stronghold. Really wishing I had a horse, man. This is such a long, boring run. <sighs> I apologize, y'all. I know this has probably been a a boring episode, seeing me, you know, fighting for my life here. Um, I didn't want to just hunker down in one village and uh, and light it all up. I could have done that. I could have thrown up. And you know, some torch spam out, just made a big safe zone, but uh, I really don't feel like that's exciting enough for you guys. So I'm trying to, uh, here we go, got the advancement. I'm trying to uh, play smart, but I'm also trying to be a little entertaining. I mean, it's not, it's not dangerous if I wall up an area and just stay put, you know gonna need to um uh, gonna need to find some diamond oh geez two of them gonna need to find some diamond gear and diamond tools really need a diamond pickaxe of course I, I know i could do the uh the lava and water trick to make another portal and then after that i can get all the uh all the uh, lava that i need so that but um it's just oh my god it's just so much easier when you've got a, a pickaxe just mine yourself some obsidian and be able to build you know a big portal if you want to all right it's a good sized little village everything is so pretty at night that's another reason why i wanted to do this everybody plays minecraft during the day and they always sleep and uh and skip the nights but look how beautiful that is look at the stars look at the way the the the, the torches light up the the buildings i love nighttime in minecraft yes it's scary yes there's monsters everywhere but um but we'll be able to handle that hey buddy want to hide here let you deal with all the dudes chasing me but yeah we'll be able to deal with that the crazy thing is is you can with enough lighting everywhere, you'd never know it was uh, was nighttime. Okay, thanks for watching, guys. Appreciate it.